and disturbing twist in the baby Gabriel case, eight-month-old Gabriel Johnson vanished in Arizona nearly a year ago. His mother has been in custody for most of that time, but on kidnapping charges. Now our Phoenix affiliate, KPHO, has obtained a chilling audio tape where you hear the mother say she killed the child. CBS News correspondent Bill Whitaker has the latest. Baby Gabriel was last seen the day after Christmas. Police still don't know whether he is alive or dead. But his 24-year-old mother, Elizabeth Johnson, claimed in a phone conversation with the baby's father that she killed their son. Where are you? Where is Gabriel? Gabriel is a monster. No, he's not. He wants to talk to girl, but the place she say? Johnson and her ex-boyfriend, Logan McQuarrie, shared joint custody. But December 27th, the day McQuarrie was supposed to get Gabriel, he received a text message from Johnson that the baby was dead. And in an audio recording obtained by CBS station KPHO, Johnson confesses to murder in chilling detail. You did not hurt Gabriel. <laughs> Johnson was on the run at the time of the alleged call and had changed her identity as police searched nationwide for both mother and son. Her motive? She believed McQuarrie was flirting with other women online and she wanted revenge. You know, she cares about me. I care about the people. And he's gone now. You know what I'm capable of. And I just wish me anyway. You just destroyed my life. I haven't destroyed anything. Yes, you have, Logan. You made me kill my baby boy. So find some new girl to make your new baby. Days later, Johnson was arrested in Florida and told police she gave the baby to strangers in Texas. She had also promised an Arizona couple, Jack and Tammy Smith, that they could adopt the baby. Johnson remains behind bars, charged with kidnapping, child abuse, and custodial interference. She is due back in court January 24th. Bill Whitaker, CBS News, Los Angeles.